have been signed to the uh, WWF in my universe. So it's uh, going to be pretty cool. Looking forward to seeing them here in action. Just made the debut of the American Superstar on the previous stream. That was cool. He came out really good. Sadly, I uh, like I said, I used a uh, template that I downloaded, and it was flagged for, uh, it was set not to re-upload, so sadly I cannot share it. But, hey, Goblin, here's the Moondogs, Rex and Spot, the newest addition to my universe, taking on uh, the Wild Samoans, Moondogs making their tag team debut. Rex was just signed today. And again, the, the name Moondogs is not in the game vocabulary, so I had to name the team the Wolfpack. Sadly, but everybody who sees them knows who they are. Here comes trouble. The following contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring. At a combined weight of 608 pounds. The Wolf Pack. The, the Moon Dogs. Dogs. One member is better than the other. These are two superstars who are equally high level. Yes, they are. I can't believe they're not. The name is not in the game. It's got to be some kind of trademark issue with the name. The WWE Universe on their feet. And their opponents at a combined weight of 668 pounds. The Wild Samoans. The WWE Universe already reaching a fever pitch upon their arrival, and we are just seconds away from a highly anticipated match. The more I think about it, the more I think I, I'm going to uh, tweak my universe even further and, and uh, have uh, each guy only in one organization. See, it'll eliminate some matches, though, you know, potential matches. That's That's my reservation to that. But it'll also create a lot of good ones, too, so... I'll probably end up doing that. Trying to make it the best that it can be for not only playing, but for viewing. And the bell is wrong getting this tag match started. When you think of tag teams that are itching to make an impact on tonight's event, you don't have to look any further than these two. Two teams with a desire to steal the show. <laughs> look at his boots. <laughs> uh oh. Oh. Had a good start there, Rex. Yeah, exactly, Goblin. Exactly. But I, I think if you do it that way, you, you end up in the long run seeing more guys in action. And that's what it's all about, seeing all of the old, old type retro guys. So, end up seeing more of them. So. But a guy like Andre the Giant, how do you not... I have him in all three organizations. How do you not have him in all three organizations? How do you pick just one? You know, body shots over and over. One to the jump. All right, Rex, get out. One step ahead there. Oh, nice shoulder block. What you got, Spot? Spot has a 95 rating. Rex is a 74, I believe. Get him, man. Get him. It doesn't matter if you're on the outside of the ring. There is no place safe when you face such a risk taker. Hey, Floyd. Welcome back. 
Get the Moon Dogs and the Samoans. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Ooh, right on point. Did it help Floyd? Good, I'm glad. Yeah, that's what I mean, Goblin. I have a lot of guys like that where it's a hard decision. I don't know what to do. And if you put them on a show that, you know, they're not used to, they may look out of place. I don't know. I'll probably end up doing that. But, yeah, he's he's one. Not everybody is on every show or multiple shows. There's just a few guys who are on multiple shows, but he is one of them. Yeah, you because know, he went everywhere, so I had I have him on all of the shows. I'll probably end up doing that, tweaking it some more. Like Bob Backlund, I'll put Bob in the in the uh, WWF. Superstar Billy Graham. Uh oh, that wasn't good. Bruno San Martino. Nikita Koloff, Ivan Koloff, those guys. Oh, look at this! I'm in trouble. Yeah, I could do that, Goblin. Like B. Brian Blair, I have him in WWF and Florida Championship Wrestling. Because he was huge in Florida Championship Wrestling. But obviously, WWF is bigger. So, maybe I'll do that. It certainly makes sense to do it that way. See more guys in action. Spot needs to get out of there. Nice back body drop to buy him some time. Rex comes in. He is. This is awesome to watch. The Moon Dogs and the Wild Samoans, they're busy. Rex has his feet on the ropes, and he gets the victory. The Moon Dogs. That sucks that the name isn't in the game. But they look good. They look good. Their entrance was good. Their move sets were good. They were tough. 